temperatures are not going to stick around much longer. At some point, it's going to feel like June, huh? <laughs> we, we will get back to those 80s in time. <laughs> so we had a little break yesterday, obviously. That high to start June was uh, 58 yesterday. Uh, looking back at the month of May, a quick review. The average high temperature for the month was 78 degrees. The rainfall was 1.63 inches. We'll have the comparisons for that coming up. But for the rainfall, we were behind by over 3 inches from where we should have been. And May is typically the wettest month of the year. So we really needed that rainfall. Yesterday, to start June, a high of 58. We were one degree away from tying the record coolest high temperature for the month of June. Today, we start that climb. We are heading back to 71 for a high temperature. Dry conditions on the WLWT radar. Good news for that. I think we'll keep it dry throughout the day today. We do have some clouds out there, but we do not have any precipitation expected today. Expect the cloud cover around this morning. Limited morning sunshine. And even with that deck of clouds, which we often talk about kind of trapping heat and keeping temperatures up, even with the clouds, we're still at 54 for the cool start this morning. We'll break free and bring back more afternoon sunshine, helping our afternoon warm up. Here's a satellite and radar with our storm system getting hung up on the east coast. It's continued to keep the cloud cover around for us. It kept the showers yesterday. We tried to build in some high pressure from the Great Lakes to move down into the Ohio River Valley. Never quite made it because of that storm system. So it's moving off to the east now. And along with it, that storm in the mid-Atlantic pushing off. And so we bring back more afternoon sun today. Day. Decreasing clouds expected, highs back in the low 70s. And then for tomorrow, a little bit of that moisture tries to edge back into our direction. So we'll have partly cloudy skies for Wednesday. We may spark off an afternoon, very isolated shower or thunderstorm. I don't think we have anything widespread. Most of us will be dry. And it looks like the latter part of the work week will kind of increase that chance just a touch. Today, 71, dry after morning clouds. We'll have more afternoon sun. A mild day today, but tonight we drop off to 56 for another cool overnight. And tomorrow, temperatures heading up 77 for Wednesday. That isolated shower or storm, I think more of them will become a little more scattered on Thursday. And then by Friday night, a cold front dropping temperatures back a few degrees. Looks like highs in the 80s, the second half of the forecast. The straightest scattered storm chances stick around through the weekend and into Monday as well. Any one location not likely to pick up rain every time, but I think we'll have uh, some activity each afternoon. And we do need that rainfall. We'll have chances throughout the forecast. Mark and Lisa.